Good morning, y'all. It's your girl Asian. I'm back again with another video. It is May 19th, 5.55 in the morning, y'all. And I'm up headed to the gym because I wanted to do a 5 a.m. girly daily productive vlog, y'all. So, God has been putting it in my spirit for me to get back up early and to get back to going to the gym consistently. I've been going to the gym consistently for like four or five months now, but lately I've been like taking like two days, three days out of the week off more. So I'm trying to get back into the groove of being more consistent and going every day besides like a true rest day, not just because I'm tired. So y'all, let me get to the gym and then we'll talk again. Peace. God, you call me by my name. The love you give me, I just can't deny. Yeah. No longer blinded, I can see you. I'm on my way to meet you. We gotta talk, you know. All these trials and tribulations got me tired, I need rest. And I heard that I can come to you when weary of my flesh. You awake me from death. God, I need you. No more walking by the flesh. That's when I leave you. God told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone, told me I'm, told me I'm, told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone, know that I'm someone, no, I'm a child of God. I don't wanna go to Godly way, close to your love again. I give my heart again, Jesus. I don't wanna go to Godly way, close to your love again. I give my heart again, Jesus I know you know me well I feel invisible until you tell me you're right here I cancel plans with you to be with sin and break your heart Sometimes I go to you for what you give, not who you are Yeah, it's so crazy getting back up early to go to the gym around 6, 7 Because y'all, literally the streets be so dead like y'all the streets real life it be dead <laughs> but but y'all um yeah i just you know i just be wanting to but come back an early girly y'all because i be waking up a little more late now since i have night school and then also just because I don't really have to wake up early no more because I'm not in barber school having to be at school at 10 and stuff like that. But y'all, it really has affected me like, because it's like I'll be waking up ready to start my morning after prayer and reading the word. And then since I now don't have to go to school at 10, it's like, I'm just like, no, nah, I'm gonna go back to sleep. No, nah, I'm gonna lay down. No, nah, I'm gonna just chill. But I had watched a podcast and they were talking about if you like if you have been trying to get that that fire back or whatever, um, if you've been trying to get that fire back from God, go back to doing the things that you were doing when you were on fire for God. So if you were waking up at 4 a.m. praying, starting your morning at 4 a.m., start back doing that. If you were reading your word for an hour in the morning an hour at night start back doing that if you were going to the gym if you were going to the gym early or after prayer and the word start back doing that like start back watching those sermons that you were watching all the time start back watching those prophetic videos start back doing the things that had you on fire for God or in that season that you felt God's presence the most so y'all I've been trying to get back into the groove of those things waking up at 4 a.m. getting in prayer reading the word then doing my prayer prayer um, board and then starting my morning getting my skin routine done early and getting dressed for the gym early and listening to that podcast on the way to the gym and filling my spirit up with more sermons and just God's presence overall y'all because it's hard out here when you trying to 
when you trying to um, do life and when you trying to do life and be this productive God fearing woman like it can get hard out here sometimes and I just want to say stay consistent stay productive to whatever God has you doing right now like stay consistent stay showing up because that consistency is going to get you far y'all like being consistent and allowing God to be the forefront and have his hands on your plans and everything that you're doing in that season of your life continue to show up and keep God first <laughs> through everything literally because I realized like when you try to rush through the word or prayer or you try to speed through your morning routine then you're easily more angered in the morning you're easily more distracted in the morning you're easily more influenced in the morning you're easier to fall into something that isn't of God if you're not filled up with his presence enough so I just want to say make sure God's hands and he is the center of everything don't just try to wake up and be like okay I'm ready to go to the gym without prayer without the armor of God over you without putting God first you know, you need to make sure before you leave your house to head to the gym that you do have the armor of God over you. You need to make sure that you are filled with the Holy Spirit and his presence so that you are guided through your day. So that you are guided through your day being intentional and purposeful. We going to get this productive Siri girl stuff going and... We just gonna get back to also being consistent with our vlogging y'all like i've been a little off my vlogging game and i don't like that because the girlies really mess with me on youtube the girlies is really feeling your girl vibe the girls really be feeling the holy spirit and god's words and wisdom through my videos okay <laughs> so i want to stay consistent with my platform spreading god's word being god's child doing what god has called me um, and has purpose for me to do okay bring people to his kingdom spread spread his word to my girls out here but yeah y'all good morning y'all we back with another video it is sunday may 19th 909 and we headed to church y'all gotta go praise the lord on this good sunday but um yeah so we just headed to church got the camera out because i got to get back on top of these vlogs um yeah but yeah y'all that's really all i got to say stay tuned for the rest of the vlog peace what's up twins hey look say hi to the camera hi. look they say goodbye we trying to get to church look at camille what up wait ah So yeah, we just made it to church, and the lighting is so bright. But I'm gonna get back to y'all. So they got the to kill sin and to grow in your relationship with Jesus, it's not too far. Like, it's a good thing. And it might look different than, like, culture. It might look different than your friends. It might look different than, like, the spouse that you're on the double date with or the couple that you're on the double date with. Um, but if that's what it takes, it's so worth it. It's, it's a great thing. Um, so... Jesus Christ, oh, he is. He's a Lord that she says. 
Jesus Christ, He is Lord. Yes. Okay, stop pulling the leaves, y'all. Stop doing that. Are you taking oh, my dad, that's high. Yeah, pet it. Oh, didn't pet him. Jordan, you pet him. Yeah, they're doing it in person. Come on, go. Pet it. Did you? Oh, pet it. Pet it. Pet it. Oh, man, it is. No, it's one right here. Pet him. You scary. <laughs> Pet him. Stop me. Don't pull their oh, face. They're, they're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> come here. Y'all give them some yeah, grass. grass. They love to eat the grass. Then they'll come to you. <laughs> there you <laughs> go. <laughs> what do you guys say? <laughs> the next day. The next day. The next day. Okay. Good morning, y'all. It's your girl, Asia, And I'm back again with another video. It's Monday. May 20th, your girl's up, headed to the gym. It's 6.52. I know yesterday I got to the gym around 6. I'm going to be running to the gym a little later, but hey, I'm getting there still early. But y'all, on today's agenda is going to be the gym. I need to go to Aldi's to get um, some small groceries. I need to go to Sam's. And... Um, uh, I have to get my son a graduation outfit and then I have cosmetology school so that's that's all on today's agenda but right now we're gonna get to, um, make it to the gym and then I'll get back to you guys later peace Your father this lies they told us so familiar they will haunt you they will kill you keep you hostage king will heal you before him adore him he will give you everything come and take your can't keep going back to what i used to know but please hold my hand as i go down this road can't keep going back Hey y'all, what's up? It is 9.50 and we headed to handle some errands. We need groceries because we ain't got none. I'm playing y'all. We really ain't got nothing though. <laughs> groceries. Um, gotta wash the car. Wash clothes. Can you raise the window up? Um, wash clothes. Clean the car out. Um, and I believe that's all. Hmm. And then I have school later. But y'all, right now we're headed to Aldi's. Gonna get um, a few things. Then gotta go to Sam's for like water and stuff. And then I wanna go eat some food while we ain't got no kids besides Camille. But yeah, so we're headed to Aldi's. I'll get back to y'all once we're there. Peace. What up, y'all? So we just got to all these, and now we about to go in here and get these groceries. I'm not getting a lot of stuff, y'all. I'm only getting a little bit of things because we don't, it's not the beginning of the month, so we're not really doing our like monthly grocery, which we shop at Sam's, but I just came to all these like, like a few weeks ago, and that was my first time coming back in like six months. So, this is more like budget friendly. This is more like budget friendly or whatever. So, yeah. So that's why we here, cause we being budget friendly because it's not the beginning of the month yet. So yeah, but y'all. Get 
the cart. Let's get the cart. You getting any meal? It's hot. My back is cooked. You pick up first? Well, let me bring your house some more. Yeah. No, just hurry up and put her in. Oh, this is good. When did bastards get this dusty? Look, I'm sitting outside and in the rain. So you get this one and then that one. This one and that one. This one and that one. Okay. Huh? I know these are good. These were good. When Allah had these, these were good. No, had Allah had and she gave me some and it was good. And I miss eating my muffins right there. I miss those cookies. Those are like the bomb.com. No, this one is on sale for five dollars instead of like six ninety something. Okay. Lock it. 